O positive. O positive is the most common blood type globally, found in roughly 4 out of every 10 people. Its most remarkable trait is its broad reach in transfusions. One unit of O positive blood can be given to any patient who is AH positive, whether their type is A, B, AB, or O. This makes O positive extremely important in medicine. In emergencies, doctors can use it to stabilize the majority of patients. Its widespread availability also means that blood banks rely heavily on donations from O-positive individuals to keep hospitals well supplied. From an evolutionary standpoint, type O blood has influenced human survival in multiple ways. For example, lacking both A and B antigens hinders the parasite, Plasmodium falciparum responsible for the deadliest form of malaria from clumping red blood cells together, thus lowering the risk of severe malaria in people with type O. Anthropologists also propose that type O was advantageous for hunter-gatherers, as their immune profiles and digestive systems adapted to high-protein diets and exposure to wild pathogens long before agriculture reshaped human health. On the other hand, having an exposed H antigen on O-type red cells provides an entry point for certain pathogens, making individuals with type O more susceptible to severe infections like cholera and norovirus. Another trait of type O is that they usually have lower baseline levels of certain clotting factors, such as von Willebrand factor. This difference offers protection against life-threatening blood clots but can also increase bleeding risk in some situations. A positive. A positive is the second most common blood type globally, present in approximately 3 out of every 10 people. It is characterized by the presence of A antigens and the AHD factor on red blood cells, meaning that individuals with A-positive blood can safely receive transfusions from both A-positive and O-positive donors. In medical practice, this gives A-positive a broad pool of compatible donors, making it one of the easiest blood types to manage in hospital settings. Its high prevalence also ensures that blood banks can maintain steady reserves for emergencies. Beyond its clinical role, type A carries evolutionary and immunological traits that have shaped how populations adapted over time. For example, the A antigen has been linked to a stronger immune response against certain bacterial infections, particularly those that spread in dense agricultural settlements where hygiene was often a challenge. This may explain why the frequency of type A increased as humans transitioned from hunter-gatherer societies to settled farming civilizations. However, the same antigen that provides these defenses has also been associated with higher risks of clotting disorders and certain cardiovascular conditions, demonstrating how evolution balances advantages with vulnerabilities. B positive. B positive blood is found in about 1 in 10 people, making it less common than type O or A, yet still significant worldwide. It is defined by the presence of B antigens on red blood cells, along with the RHD factor. In transfusions, B-positive individuals can safely receive blood from B-positive, B-negative, O-positive, or O-negative donors, giving them a moderate range of compatibility. However, due to its lower frequency, maintaining adequate supplies of B-positive blood requires more targeted donation drives compared to O and A types. From an evolutionary perspective, type B blood shows a fascinating distribution pattern, it is especially concentrated in parts of Asia and the Middle East, suggesting that ancient migrations and selective pressures caused it to spread unevenly across the globe. Research also links the B antigen with altered susceptibility to certain infections, providing protection against some bacteria while leaving individuals vulnerable to others. Additionally, type B has been noted in metabolic studies, with some evidence of differences in how people with this blood type metabolize carbohydrates and fats. These subtle distinctions reveal that blood types are more than transfusion labels. They are evolutionary fingerprints reflecting how humans adapted to different environments over thousands of years. AB positive. AB positive is the rarest of the major positive blood types, carried by less than 5% of the global population. Its defining trait is the presence of both A and B antigens on red blood cells, along with the RHD factor. Because of this full antigen set, AB-positive individuals can receive red blood cells from any donor A, B, AB, or O, whether the donor is positive or negative. 
This makes AB positive the universal recipient in transfusion medicine, a unique advantage when blood supplies are limited or emergencies demand quick compatibility. Evolutionary studies suggest that AB is the youngest blood type, emerging only a few thousand years ago through the mixing of A and B populations. Its rarity makes it valuable to researchers studying genetic diversity, since it represents a blending of two distinct antigen systems into one. However, the same antigens that give AB positive its broad compatibility are associated with trade-offs. For example, type AB individuals show higher susceptibility to certain clotting and vascular conditions compared to those with type O. Still, having AB positive means belonging to one of the smallest blood groups in the world while also having the widest transfusion safety net, an unusual evolutionary combination of scarcity and advantage. O negative. O negative is one of the most vital and medically significant blood types, even though it's carried by less than 7% of the global population. Its defining characteristic is the complete absence of A, B, and RHD antigens on red blood cells. Because of this unique feature, O negative can be safely transfused into anyone, regardless of their blood group, earning it the title of the universal red cell donor. In emergency wards and disaster zones, where every second counts and blood typing is impossible, O negative is the first and often life-saving choice. From an evolutionary perspective, its rarity highlights how unusual it is to lack all three major blood antigens. The absence of these markers greatly reduces the chance of immune rejection during transfusions, but it also brings weaknesses. People with type O tend to be more vulnerable to severe cholera and norovirus infections because of the exposed H antigen. Moreover, O negative mothers require careful medical monitoring during pregnancy to prevent hemolytic disease in newborns. Despite its scarcity, O negative remains irreplaceable in medicine, a silent safeguard of humanity vital to every hospital and emergency system worldwide. A negative. A negative is among the rarest blood types, found in less than 2% of the world's population. Its red blood cells contain the A antigen but lack the AHD factor, which limits transfusion compatibility. People with A negative blood can only receive donations from A negative or O negative donors, making their compatible donor pool quite small. In medical settings, this scarcity gives every A negative donation special importance. Sometimes it's the only safe option for a patient in need. From an evolutionary standpoint, the A antigen has been linked to stronger immune defenses against bacterial infections, offering an advantage in early farming societies where close living conditions increased exposure to disease. However, the absence of the HD factor creates complications during pregnancy. If an A-negative mother carries an RH-positive baby, her immune system may produce antibodies that can harm the child's red blood cells. Modern medicine manages this with preventive treatment, but in earlier times, it likely affected survival and reproduction. The mix of rarity, immune strength, and reproductive challenges makes a negative a blood type defined by both hidden protections and delicate vulnerabilities. B-negative. B-negative is one of the rarest blood types, accounting for only about 1% of the global population. This type is defined by the presence of B antigens on red blood cells and the absence of the RHD factor, RAHD antigen. Because of this configuration, individuals with B negative blood can safely receive transfusions only from B negative or O negative donors, which severely limits their options for blood transfusion. In hospitals, this scarcity means that B-negative donations are carefully managed and considered high priority for patients who depend on them. From an evolutionary perspective, type B blood likely spread unevenly among ancient populations. It reached higher frequencies in some parts of Asia but was far less common in Africa and Europe, and it was historically almost absent in the Americas. Furthermore, the requirement of being Rh-negative, lacking the Rhd factor, narrows its distribution even more, contributing to its extreme rarity today. Some research suggests that people with blood type B may exhibit altered responses to certain bacterial and viral infections compared to other blood groups, reflecting subtle evolutionary trade-offs in immunity. Consequently, B-negative individuals stand out not only for their scarcity, but also for carrying one of the most selectively distributed antigen profiles in human history.
AB negative. AB negative is the rarest of all eight main blood types, found in less than half a percent of people worldwide. Its red blood cells carry both A and B antigens, but lack the RHD factor, a combination that makes it extraordinarily uncommon. In transfusion medicine, AB negative plasma is uniquely valuable, as it can be given to recipients of any blood type, earning it the title of universal plasma donor. However, AB negative red cells are extremely scarce, and individuals with this type can receive blood only from AB negative, A negative, B negative, or O negative donors. From an evolutionary standpoint, AB is considered the youngest blood type, believed to have appeared just a few thousand years ago through the merging of A and B populations. The added absence of the RHD factor makes AB negative even more exceptional, a true genetic rarity among humans. This scarcity highlights both the richness and fragility of blood inheritance. People with AB negative blood make up only a tiny fraction of humanity, yet their plasma is of immense importance to modern medicine. In a sense, possessing AB negative is like carrying the rarest blend of all major antigen traits, a biological signature that sits at the far edge of human diversity. See the world differently. Subscribe to understand.